As part of the ongoing reform efforts to deepen staff skills and competencies, as well as improve on career prospects, the Nigeria Immigration Service has kick-started a four-day technical working committee meeting in Lagos in partnership with the International Center for Migration Policy and Development. The multi-stakeholders technical working committee has participants from both the private and government institutions, including developmental partners, Deputy Controller General of Immigration and Chairman of the committee, Mohamed Aminu Mohamed, who also heads the Border Management Directorate of the service, said the essence of the meeting is to deepen conversations on the efforts by the service to modernize its capacity building and career development activities with a view to making career development not only demand-driven but also linked to personnel performance and training activities. Upscaling the capacity of immigration service you all agree with me that immigration management is a phenomenon that is evolving. So Nigeria cannot be static. We have to upscale our staff in terms of training so that they can cope with the modern immigration management so that we can sync with the global practice. If you want to have it well, you have to update yourself in terms of skills and knowledge. So what we are trying to do now is we are taking stock of what we have on ground and see where we are liking or what and what we think will bring on board. The uh, collaboration between ICMPD and uh, uh, NIS, Nigeria Immigration Service, uh, dates back to many, many years before now. Uh, we have been uh, uh, supporting the Nigeria Immigration Service on Blue Borders. Uh, we have been supporting in capacity building, uh, border management, uh, under the support to free movement of persons and migration funded by the EU. Uh, we uh, are also um, uh, discussing with uh, the NIS on many, many other uh, fronts, and this one is just uh, one of them.